control your inbox. This is a big one. How many of you, be honest, look at your emails every few minutes? How many of you have notifications pop up on your phone alerting you that you have a new email? Or that you have a Facebook message or a Facebook comment? And it feels so good because it releases dopamine, right? And it's instant gratification. And we get excited. We're like, oh, I have a message. Oh, it's not really important. Oh, somebody liked my video. Oh, I don't even know that person. Oh, somebody left a comment. Oh, it was a bad comment. Right? We're setting ourselves up, not only for negativity and disappointment, but we're setting ourselves up to waste more precious minutes. And one of those minutes you wasted could have been the minute that you got your breakthrough. One of those minutes could have been the, one of the minutes that gave you the result, that gave you the listing, that gave you the appointment. One of those wasted minutes. Minutes are precious. They're valuable. We must control our inbox. So shut off notifications on your phone today. Shut them off. I don't want to see any Facebook message, any Facebook notifications pop up on my phone ever. I don't want to see an Instagram notification pop up on my phone ever. I don't want to see an email notification pop up on my phone ever. The only thing I want to see is a text message. And if I could control that and still have my wife's come through, if somebody knows how to do that, let me know, then I would do it. Because that's really the only notification I need to see is if my wife texts me about the children or about something important. I don't need to see any other notifications until I'm ready to see the notifications. Does that make sense? We have to manage our time. If not, the time manages us and then we're dictated by the notification. And now we find ourselves doing non-productive task. So what do we do? We schedule a time to check those things. We schedule a time to check emails. We schedule a time to go on Facebook. We schedule a time to do those things. For some people, depending on your business, you might could do this three times a day. And some of you are laughing because you know you couldn't make it on just three times a day. But if you're not a realtor, if you're in just another business where you're not getting constant notifications and emails from clients and agents and title companies and lenders and inspectors, you might could do a morning, lunch, and afternoon, late afternoon check. But maybe if you're more busy and you rely a lot on notifications and emails, maybe you do it once an hour. Maybe every hour you spend five minutes going through your last hour of emails. And then after that, you're done. You don't look at it for at least another hour. 